is a definer of our culture and our uh, language is our culture it's very important that the essence of the language native languages in particular need to be preserved because they're so expressive and they come from a very rich history a time before contact a time before calendars and clocks and and existence of the modern world As Indian people, we have become acculturated but not assimilated. We have not assimilated because we still operate from our value system. We still operate from that hard wiring that we have. Our cultural imperative is to understand where we came from and to be connected to that past and that part of us. language offers that bridge between the past and today. So it's important that we keep that connection. I know some Eskimo, I've learned some of my language because my grandma is Eskimo from Alaska. She lived in a really small village. Really, there's one school in the whole village. There's one post office in the whole village and they're like the only two buildings that have running water. It seems to me like only the elders speak the language up there. It's the same how what happened on reservations, like another culture came there. It was uh, the Lutheran church. And they were like, oh, you can't speak your language in school. You can't speak your language in church. They almost made it to where people were ashamed to speak their language. And I think because of that, there was a generation somewhere where they didn't teach their kids to speak. If they offered Navajo as a language in an urban city, I think that would be an honor, actually. With technology, that's how our students relate to globalization. feel like the need to interact with kids abroad here in the states as well as internationally. But I think if they saw a program where a Diné language is being offered as a course of study like Spanish or French, I think that would perk their interest. 
because now we see some of them that are still a little bit ashamed to speak their language. And I think that started back when boarding schools uh, were here on the reservation. For our generation and for those to come after, we have to preserve those teachings, whether it be written, be through a video, through YouTube, we have to preserve it.